You see your mommy? Oh my gosh. I don't know what she just hit. Take me to the camera. nice out here in Georgia uh, it's about five o'clock and the weather is beautiful got a nice breeze sun's out no clouds in the sky so Mercer's home I was with the baby all day I was like look I'm going outside I'm gonna go cut some grass bush hog all this stuff this is our front pasture and a lot of that around the burn pile has already been cut just because we burnt it last November and didn't want to start a fire. But yeah, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna get to cutting on this and see what it looks like after. Well, let's get to it. outside he scratched the crap out of my face he's pulled most of my hair out of my bun snatched my glasses off a couple times gotten a snack everywhere yeah you see mommy that was cute sir freaking pollen she said I want you to watch me cut down all this big stuff video it I said, okay. I've got bugs and gnats swarming, swarming my face. Is that a good thing, you sir? I don't know if you can tell in the video, but it's so yellow. Like, yes, it's some like dust and dirt and stuff, but that is mostly the pollen that's been in the air, settling on that grass right there. And when she cuts it, and just makes it all go up into the air, right and through my nostrils. Yeah, so we're not a big fan of this pollen season, are we? We get allergies. This is another animal pen we're gonna need to clean up. It's our big one, probably like where we put cows and stuff. Um, it needs some work. That back fence is pretty much because the people who own the land right behind it, they are just like a lumber company. So they only just grow the trees, come and cut them down every like, I don't know how many years. So it gets overgrown and stuff falls on our fence and tears it down. It's a pain in the arse. See you, mommy. Oh my gosh. 
I don't know what she just hit, but it's a lot of dust. Maybe we should stand upwind of the dust. How about that? We're kind of screwed right now. Just got them hickle mouse. That's where we do the bonfires. It's usually giant. Um, we always, when we do our tear downs, which y'all saw in the goat pen video, we've got all those trees start hauling over there. We just haven't done yet. Try and wait until they die off or we don't do it the same day. But since it's just us two and a half, we don't have a lot of time to spend outside hauling things around, especially now that I have a job. so dusty out here but I got a lot of this cut probably about five acres worth looking pretty good still got all that but it's coming along when we flow John Deere little five foot br brush hog it's doing the job looking good still got all that over there to do though camera doesn't do it just well I got a lot done I think I'm done for the day still got way over there to do but we did a lot I'm freaking dirty there's pollen I mean everywhere all over the tractor I gotta get this off oh I'm gonna have to blow this tractor off with the air compressor oh it's just Stacked up on here. Woo! Pick that out. Try to take care of your stuff. It'll last longer. I mean, good gosh. I oh, got a lot cut today, that's for sure. Pollen, pollen, pollen. I'm gonna have to go clean my nose out with a, that neti pot or whatever the hell it's called. Because this stuff, oh, horrible. Well, looks a lot better. None of that tall standing, whatever the heck. I asked, that stuff was taller than me. That stuff was almost as tall as this tractor. Oh, all right, let's get this back to the barn. I think I'm gonna spray it off tomorrow. Let the engine cool down. Well, that's it for today. I'll be back tomorrow to finish the rest. Okay, so that's a couple days after I bush hogged this field. I got a lot done. Actually, it took me a couple hours to do it. Um, I only got a five foot brush hog, but that's all right. It'll get the work done. It might take some time, but we, we got some done. Um, but this is where it was all like grown up with that. I don't even know what it's called. This stuff was taller than me. That ain't saying much, but still. But all this is cut now. There's the burn pile. And then there's a little bit over here. You can kind of tell that I've got to cut. That's, that, that ain't much to do. So I gotta finish that up. But I wanted to do this video for my nephew because he is in love with tractors. He wants to ride it all the time. He wants to talk about it. He wants to see it. He wants to see videos on your phone of it. He will sit there for hours and just tractor, Mimi tractor, Rip Red tractor, loves it. Just wants to talk about it. So this one's for you, buddy. I love you. And I hope you love this video. If y'all have stuck around this long, um, I know it's kind of boring, but 
you know, things got to be done around here, and we're just recording it. Yeah, um, yeah. So if you've stuck around this long, give us a big old thumbs up and uh, click that subscribe button, and hopefully we'll see y'all on the next video. Peace. Thank you.